So we're conducting a multiple response analysis of university student satisfaction data. I've got here 50 demo cases who have responded to the question what's most satisfying about university for you and they can make up to two responses. This, that would be satisfaction most one and their second response could be sat most two. Not everybody's done two responses so this person gave one response but not a second. Uh, there's also then a question about what was least satisfying and I've created coding columns for each of these variables. Having read over these, these responses I came up uh, with these five or six categories. First category is around social opportunities and general atmosphere of the university. Category 2 is about the facilities and services, such as the library. Category 3 is about the learning opportunities, such as tutorials, lectures, um, uh, work integrated learning. Chapter f uh, Topic 4 is about staff, lecturers, tutors, etc. Uh, category 5 is about the IT services. And Chapter 6 is for any other things that don't fit into those categories. So I've then been going through each response, reading it, reading them, and going, well, that's category one, atmosphere and social opportunities. By putting in the uh, value labels, it means that I can switch on uh, or toggle on the sh showing of codes. So when I, I've done all of this column, I'm now on this one. If I want to code online Moodle, then I can click here to the pull down menu and choose IT. Uh, social networks could be part of atmosphere, Moodle part of IT, uh, course outlines, probably other. Moodle uh, is an IT, library is a facility and service, etc. Alright. So I've finished coding now, and uh, earlier I had set up the multiple response set. Uh, however, I may need to set this again. So I have these two coding variables. Categories range from 1 to 5. Give the set a name. Click on Add and then Close. Now I can go into here and I can choose either frequencies or cross tabs. So for a basic analysis, I just want frequencies of the satmost set. And this will give me um, really two types of analysis, uh, both of which are helpful. So if in this section, I have the percentage of responses. So I had uh, 49 in my sample who gave 83 responses. So overall there was 170% say of people responding or 170% responses means that each person gave on average about 1.7 responses. Now the breakdown of, res of responses indicates that the most common type of response was atmosphere and social opportunities, closely followed by staff, uh, and then followed by learning facilities uh, and IT. Um, not sure why other hasn't come out there. And we can also look at the results as percentage of cases. Now this means that 43% of students mention the staff as one of their most satisfied aspects. And uh, actually slightly higher was 45% of students are mentioning the atmosphere and social, social opportunities. So we can talk about the results in terms of responses and or percentage of cases. And you could use this data if you wished in a table.